Kaya 1-1 ball game and then defensively things kind of fell apart in the one inning. What was the cause of that lack of concentration at that point? You think that maybe they'd be a little sharper right there, especially knowing the game's on the line? Well, you know, we'd taken the lead 3-1 to one in, the, in the bottom half of the previous inning, and I don't know if they relaxed, uh, kind of started just maybe took a mental leave from, from where we were. Uh, I made a defensive substitution and had a hard shot uh, line drive, those are kind of hard plays to make when it's right at you. Uh, it kind of, it, you know, it handcuffed her a little bit. Uh, but then we drop a pop fly in the infield, we kick the ball around on a ground ball, we can't throw it to the right base, we misjudge a fly ball that leads to two more runs with a shot in the left center field. I just, you know, it's one of those things I guess you call it is softball. Yeah. And, um, they, you can't make seven errors against a team like Connorsville and, and expect to come out on top. You can't make seven errors against anybody yeah. uh, and expect to come out on top. Is the adjustment period still happening? I know you've been the head coach for a long time, but then the changes over the offseason and such. Does that matter? Because really your core of your team is still here. Oh, the, the, the group of girls. Yeah, I mean, I know who the girls are, and they know who you know who I am, too. It's a... Uh, I don't, I really, Troy really don't know the answer to that question right now. I don't think there's an adjustment period as much as, as they, they kind of got off to a slow start 0-3. Mm -hmm. um, you know, they got a nice win last night, and now here we are with kind of that one inning just kind of crept up to bite us. Um, we'll, we'll get it figured out. You know, yeah. we're going to take a nice little day tomorrow and just kind of regroup and, and, and move on past today and look for, I mean, the old saying is, you know, it's not a sprint, it's a marathon. Yeah. Well, you know, okay, we're one and four. Well, if if we're one and twenty-five come tournament time, I know we're going to be a, we're going to be one of those one and twenty-five teams that nobody wants to play. What about this weekend? What do you have coming up? Got the uh, Richmond invite. Okay. Uh, Jay County and Centerville and us uh, are, are going to play. A, uh, we play Jay County uh, at for uh, ten o'clock in the morning. Uh, they then turn around. Jay County will play Centerville, say like at noon or twelve thirty. And then we follow up with a game with Centerville at uh, probably right around 2.30, 3 o'clock. So really overall a couple of good tests for you, though, as you get back into the swing of things. Oh, absolutely, because Jay County's always tough. As And, and Avon and, and the folks at Centerville have done, you know, he's done a great job since he's taken over that program. they got a, they got a solid young lady in the circle, uh, and, and Lauren Honk, uh, Honkamp, and uh, we're, we got our work cut out for us. So we'll see what we're made of come Saturday.